Hi, I'm Brian, and you're watching Someplace or Another. And today, I'm touring around Columbia, Missouri. Uh, right now, I'm at the largest bur oak tree in the nation. The largest tree in the state of Missouri. It's estimated to be 350 years old. Hmm, what if I got that right? Let's go check it out. Well, I thought maybe I was crazy, but apparently, I'm not alone. <laughs> so this is a big tree, 350 years old. That's pretty cool. Let's see if we get farther away. Now that's an iconic shot, the bur oak. So I wonder how they knew this is the biggest tree, or the oldest. It's pretty nice. Looks like they had to trim it back a little bit. Must have had some damage. It's a big tree. Man, look how big it is compared to the people. Wow. Somebody last week, yesterday? Yesterday. Yeah, it's a big one. That's what humans have been doing for 3,000 years. That's pretty neat. Yeah. Hmm. Half of the stuff that we find in ancient culture. Look at these guys. You guys made it. Well, it's official. I'm not crazy. <laughs> it's a pretty cool looking tree. Let's go see what uh, Columbia has to offer. All right, you're looking at the Wright Brothers Mule Barn. I think there's a plaque over here. Right now, I think it's an apartment. Well, let's go look at the plaque. The Diggs Building. Huh. Feel free to hit pause if you want to read this. Leading meal manufacturer, if I remember correctly. Okay, let's go find something else. <laughs> I think Beetle Bailey is around here somewhere. I'm going to see if I can figure out where he's at. <sighs> I found him. He's sitting on a bench. Let's go say hi. Oh, Beetle Buddy. Having a cold one? How's it going? We got our, I'm assuming that's a cold one. There's a knife. You have a cheese or crackers or a sausage? Must have finished it already. Well. Oh. oh. So, without actually reading the sign, the creator came, went to the school. Okay, off to my next stop. Can only illegally park for a little while before they come get ya. <laughs> that wasn't too hard to find. Let's go, uh, this place is... <laughs> it looks pretty toasted. <laughs> the Arrowhead Motel. That's a neat uh, neon sign. Pretty cool looking. Don't look to be too well. No, it's missing a little bit of neon. The motel itself looks pretty much done for. There's a uh, keep out signs everywhere, so we will be doing that. I found something quirky just that way down the street. <laughs> Let's go check that out. Well. <laughs> Honestly, I have no idea what that was to start with. But I said it was quirky. What? What was that? Huh. No problem. Your wife called and she said she can buy whatever you want. Although the place looks like it's closed. Oh, well, neon's on. It's probably open. There's the Tiger Motel. Hotel. I was looking for that. 
We're gonna get a car tour because I don't feel like parking. Very nice. The historic district is hopping. It is a Saturday around four ish, in case you're curious. I think this is going to be my last stop. Right outside the college. And this picture does not do it justice. It's much, much bigger. <laughs> Finding Corky in Columbia has seemed to be tricky for me. Plus parking, it's pretty busy down here. All right, thanks for watching. I will see you guys someplace or another. Have a great day, bye. Stay tuned for more adventure to come. Subscribe, like, share, and thanks for watching, bye.